Hey everyone, welcome back. It's time to learn how to set up a recovery contact for your Apple account. Losing access to your Apple account password can seriously disrupt your digital life. It will lock you out of your devices, prevent access to iCloud, and even block you from managing your app and service subscriptions. When two-factor authentication is enabled, Apple can't simply reset your password for you. While setting up a recovery key is one option, you will still need both the key and a trusted device to reset your password. To simplify your account recovery, Apple offers the option to add a recovery contact. This is a trusted person who can help verify your identity and assist you in regaining access to your account and data if you ever get locked out. That's it. Let's get started. So first off, let's learn how to invite someone to be your recovery contact. It's worth pointing out that if you're using a macOS device, you can find the same options inside System Settings and Apple Account. And if you're using an iPhone or iPad, open the Settings app. And then you have to tap the account banner at the top of the main menu. And then you have to tap Sign In and Security option. And under Recovery Methods, tap Recovery Contacts. Then you have to read the on-screen information and tap Add Recovery Contact and Authenticate. Then you have to choose a recovery contact. Note that if you are part of a family sharing group, eligible contacts will appear in the options. Alternatively, tap Choose someone else to search your contacts. And then you have to tap Next and following the screen allows you to send your chosen contact a message letting them know you have added them as your recovery contact. You can send the default message or edit it before sending. Then you have to tap send and when you are ready, make sure to tap on the done button and that's about it. Remember to save the person's phone number so that you can contact them if need help with account recovery. And now it's time to learn how to help someone regain access to their account. If for someone's designated recovery contact, here is how you can help them. They'll first have to verify some of their Apple account information and then they will contact you over the phone or in person. On Mac, the same options can be found inside System Settings and Apple Account section. On your iPhone or iPad, open the Settings app and then you have to tap on the Apple ID banner at the top. Then you have to select Sign In and Security option. After that, select Account Recovery. Then you have to tap your contact's name. Then you have to tap Get Recovery Code. And when your friend is ready, read them their recovery code. And once they have entered it on their device, they'll be able to reset their password and regain access to their Apple account. And finally, it's time to learn how to remove yourself as a recovery contact. If you no longer want to be someone's recovery contact, follow these quick steps on your iOS device. Or if you're using a macOS device, just head over to the System Settings app and select Apple account. And if you're using your iPhone or iPad, open the Settings app and then you have to tap on the Apple ID banner at the top. Then you have to select Sign In and Security option. And then you have to choose the Account Recovery option. And under Account Recovery for section, tap the person's name. And finally, you have to tap on Remove Contact and confirm it. And that's about it. After completing these quick steps, the contact will automatically receive a message explaining that you are no longer their account recovery contact. And that's all there is to it. So that's how you can easily set up a recovery contact for your Apple account on your iPhone, iPad, and Mac, depending on your needs. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like and share it and do subscribe for more such handy tips and tricks. And I'll catch you up in the next one.